Okay, uh, golf cart cold start anyone? This has been sitting in its exact spot for about three, four weeks, if not longer. Actually, let's go four, four to five weeks to be exact. Um, it has been half tarped. I don't know the condition of the battery. The battery is in it, obviously. It was winterized, but I have uh, since dewinterized it. And it should actually start. I'm going to show you how to do a uh, cold start on a club car golf cart without taking off. So a lot of people think, oh, you can't start them without driving them. Yes, you can. you got to put them in service mode. So we'll put it in service mode and uh, we'll see what happens. First of all, let me uh, get the snow off of it. Okay. Just uh, quickly cleared the snow off, and as you can see, there's not much under here on the engine. And, uh, obviously, battery, like I said, is still in it. Let's uh, see if we still have power. Yep, we got power. So, what you want to do is you want to come down here. This is your forward, and forward neutral and reverse. You want to pull this piece out right here and turn it. Cut locks back in. We should be in service mode now. So, let me get the keys out, and uh, we'll see if it will start. Okay, I had to turn down the radio because uh, as soon as I put the key on, the radio turned on. So let me try and get in here. It'll be a lot easier if I can actually sit on it. But I don't want to take off. I don't really want to do a burnout. So let's... Uh... Okay, the brake came off. Okay, we're not in service mode. Let's uh, try... Oh, one second here. This might be wet. There we go. We're cranking now. I forgot you had to put, uh, when you're in service mode, this actually has to be in neutral, not in forward or reverse, because if it's in forward or reverse, service mode does not work, and it defeats the purpose of service mode. So let's see what happens. It is cranking, there we go. Show get more. Got oil pressure right away. She is cold. There we go. I'm going to try and let it run for a little bit here. Definitely was not a cranker wanker. There we go. back on the idle a little bit this thing when it's cold it always jumps up really really high oil pressure and the oil pressure always backs off to about um, 40 pounds or so let's try and an engine shot. There we go. And I always bump that horn. It kind of sucks where it is, but it's not a huge deal. So there we go. About a minus uh, 10 golf cart cold start so talk to me later please keep it right neck like always and uh please drive a comment maybe some more coming up